Following the Florida school shooting, college campuses are doing their best to make sure their students feel safe. Here in Flagstaff, security and law enforcement officers are making sure they are prepared and practiced in the event of an active shooter situation. Reporter Saka Kalsoyas has the story. NAU police say they are always focused on student safety, and if the worst were to happen, they are ready. In the meantime, active shooter training is available for faculty, staff, and students. NAUPD spokesman Kevin Duffy says more than 560 people participated in 14 training sessions last year. We teach to the national standard. Um, it's based off of FEMA, uh, the FBI, and the Department of Homeland Security. Um, and that standard is the run, hide, fight protocol. In addition to these training sessions, NAU's Emergency Management Department also provides informational resources. Those do have the protocols on there, the run, hide, fight. I would encourage people to look at those protocols um, and start making a plan. There's also a lot of safety trainings online um, that we offer for active shooters. I believe the link is at nau.edu slash safety training. Um, there's active shooter presentations on there for um, students and faculty and staff. Active shooter situations are also on the minds of administrators at Coconino Community College. CCC recently hired a new chief of security. Gregory J is an experienced law enforcement officer. They brought me on because of my background. I have a law enforcement career, uh, which I retired from here in Flagstaff uh, for over 20 years. I've got knowledge uh, with that experience uh, that I have gained in that 20 years in response to active shooter situations specifically. NAU's Kevin Duffy says training is important, but the eyes and ears of students and faculty are the first line of defense. Right, any suspicious behavior, um, if you see someone acting suspicious, um, don't be afraid to call us. Saki Kalsoyas, NAZ Today.